everybody, welcome back to the Jake's FIFA Fire new channel. And yes, I said we're back with a video I made last year, and we're doing it again. It's second time around in this video. Rating Premier League home kits for the teams that are in the Premier League this season, guys. Obviously, hope you're going to enjoy this video. Smash like, subscribe onto the channel. Let's get into this one. So last year I did have my friend with it, but bottom there actually, who plays for like me on my videos, go and watch them now if you haven't, but um, they're not here today because they could not be on this video today sadly, um, as they are doing stuff, but um, yeah guys, on the first kit, look at the Bournemouth home kit, um, I don't really like it to be fair, I don't like the, des no, I don't like the, if you look there, if you look like this bit here, I don't like the design. I just think it's not really a great design for a like, Bournemouth. I like just a plain Bournemouth kit. That would be nice. But guys, if I had to give this a rating, it'd probably be 6 out of 10 I'd give Bournemouth. It looks alright. Moving on to the Gooners themselves. I ate them in the inside. Arsenal. To be fair with you, this kit is quite nice. To be fair, just for an Arsenal kit, it's just a nice little white stripe to the top with a collar. Um, I think it looks alright. I think they could have done a little bit better with designing it. I think it's a bit plain. But, um, and, you know, sometimes you want plain kits. But, um, for this kit, guys, mm, probably give it another, I'd probably give it a 6.5 out of 10. Something like that. That uh, is definitely better than the Bournemouth home kit. The Bournemouth home kit I don't really like. Um, moving on to the Aston Villa home kit. Um, no. No. Guys, this just doesn't suit. I don't think if you look at I don't like the um like that. I don't like where it goes down like that. I don't, the design just doesn't look nice. I I, I see what they've done with it, but like it just I don't think it suits the villa. Like it just don't suits the villa colours. I think they've made the um Clara a bit dark and I think it's just no. Nah. So guys, this one is gonna be the worst one rated so far. I'm gonna give it a five out of ten. I don't like it. I think it's probably it's the worst get out of them three. Moving on to Brentford. I rated this kit last was it last season? Yeah last season as well but um brentford have not changed home kit as um i think it's for like um money reasons or something um they've kept the same home kit for the next season as well so um that is brentford's home kit um again and i can't remember what i got i can't remember what i gave it last year but this year if you look at it, yeah it's just a nice little brentford kit like they don't need any big old design on it i think it looks nice i'm gonna give that the best one so far, a 7 out of 10. I think he actually looks like a nice kit, to be fair. Moving on to the Brighton home, Brighton home kit. This kit has to be probably one of the best kits I've seen this season. I think last season, they were, they did, they were, I think they were like the best home and away kit last season, I think, for me. I think they were. And they probably might even be winning this home kit one again for a second year in a row. Because this home kit they've made is absolutely beautiful. The yellow collar, the yellow down there, the yellow, it's so nice. The colour combination is so good, guys. This one, I'm 100% giving a 9 out of 10. It tops it by miles, easily. One of the best kits. Moving on to Chelsea, who I ate as well. This kit is just plain, just too plain. And the, the little light blue just doesn't work, I don't think. It, it just doesn't work with that Chelsea kit. I see what they're trying to do, but no. No, guys, this kit just doesn't work for me. Uh, for me, I have to give this a 6 out of 10. I just don't really think it looks overly all great. I'm just going to check OB. Yeah, it's really good for about 4 minutes. Nice. Moving on to Palace. This kit, everybody said this is a terrible kit. I like this. It is a good combination. I think the red little scribble, and then like the red has got the blue in the middle scribble. I think that looks nice, guys. Can't, cannot lie. This kit has to be an 8 out of 10 from Palace. I think they are local to me. They're really near to me. And I think this is about a 15 minute drive away from Palace. They're not even that far. But to be fair, guys, Palace have tops on this kit. Fair play to them. Moving on to Everton. This kit, people say it's so plain. doesn't look nice. It looks lovely. With the little, like, if you look really closely the where my mouse is here, you can see like the, the little design it looks nice the sponsor hate if they st if they still had kazoo then it would look it would probably get a nine out of ten but without the kazoo it just doesn't look that nice well 
um, response. So probably a 7.5 out of 10 for Everton. Mate, this Brighton one's still winning it by miles, I think. The Leeds one. It's alright, to be fair. It's a decent kit. It's just decent. Like, it's not been released yet, so I ain't got a proper um, thing of the kit. Um, the new kit will be home on so late August 2022. Jeez. Um, but, um, yeah, guys, that's the Leeds kit. That kit probably gets another 7. 7 out of 10. Nothing else to say. The Leicester home kit. Now, this is what I'm talking about. This kit looks nice from Leicester. Leicester pulled off a master kit here. That, that looks beautiful. The golden badge, the golden Adidas sponsor with the blue and the white. It looks beautiful, guys. This kit is 100% getting an 8 out of 10. It looks beautiful. Lovely. The Man City kit. I absolutely hate this kit. What's the badge doing? And I just no, 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 no. They got it all wrong. What's that red bit? What's that? No, guys, this is stupid. Yeah, but this is gonna be now the worst rate rated kit. A four point five out of ten. That is terrible. Hate that kit. If you even like that kit, if you even buy it, that kit, <laughs> oh my days, that's so bad. Okay, moving on to the Liverpool kit. It's just plain. Again, just plain. It's all right, guys, but for a hundred pounds, that is stupid. For a hundred pounds for that top, that top, no, it's just too plain. I think, guys, that one's gonna get a six out of ten once again. How many six out of tens are we having? Moving on to Manchester United. This kit I like. I think it's a nice additional kit um, with. Um, Team Euro once again with the black stripes and the Adidas and the Manchester United logo in like a box. Um, so to be fair, this kit will get another. We'll get an eight out of ten. Nothing is topping Brighton's one right now. This kit here just beautiful. Moving on to Newcastle's kit. It looks alright to be fair. It just looks like a normal Newcastle kit. I think the white they've made a bit strong, quite re like really strong white and a quite strong light blue which is one thing i don't like because the light blue is making the kits not make like taking up a bit of the size of the kit which is one thing i don't like so sadly that's what's going to put the kit down to a 6.5 out of 10. it would have been probably an 8 but with the spawn with the with the color just not looking that nice to be fair moving on to the nottingham forest shirt i like this it's just plain from forest a little bit of like Design on the arm, and just no sponsor. They don't even have a sponsor. That actually looks lovely. No sponsor for Nottingham Forest. And I've uh, got to say, guys, this kit is an 8.5 out of 10. It is the second best kit so far. They, this one is an absolute beautiful kit. Whew. Now that is something. Whew. Moving on to. Mm, the Southampton kit. The South. This is the, not the away kit, guys. This is their home kit. This. No. 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 Your colours are red, and you're doing a white kit. What has gone wrong here? What's the red design? Oh well, no, guys. What have they done here, Southampton? All I'm saying is a three out of ten. Worst kit so far. Even worse than the Man City one. That's awful. This is just no. Oh, I'll get this off my screen, please. Moving on to the kit I'm wearing right now. The um the Tottenham home kit with the um Champions League badge on the side, the cinch. This kit, people hate it, and I'm not even being biased, it's a nice kit. It is a nice kit. It's gonna give it an eight out of ten the Tottenham kit. I think it's a I think it's a nice kit. It's just nice. We've got a bit of colour with that little light light like green colour there with a bit of dark blue. That looks nice guys. Eight out of ten for Tottenham. Eight now I'm gonna go eight point five actually. Not even being biased, eight point five out of ten for Tottenham. They're the they're the tired second best kit. This West Ham kit, all I have to say is rubbish. I'm not even being biased here, it is rubbish. What's this design? What's just no, the colour. It looks like a training kit, mate. It looks just like a training kit. That is not a home kit. That can't be a home kit. No. No. That cannot be a home kit. Guys, just no. Please, please. 
guys i just know this kit's probably going to get six out of ten highest and moving on to the last kit guys the wolves home kit it's all right if you look here it's got the black stripe with the woman, the castori, and it's got like the red line with the sponsor with all this on the side with the castori. And it looks alright, I guess. Mm, probably have to give this a 7 out of 10. And guys, your winner for the home kit, the home kit, obviously, best home kit in the Premier League this season is Brighton. If I was a Brighton fan, I'd be buying this the second it came out because this kit is an absolute beauty. Uh, if I was a Brighton fan, I'd wear this every day. I do not care. It's probably one of the best kits I've seen. And I love this shirt. Love this shirt, guys. Just hands down. Brighton make amazing kits every single season. They never, ever like disappoint. They're always great with their kits, guys. And, um, yes, yeah, so a Brighton win. Thank you all for watching, guys, My this video. And like, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you, see, see you soon, guys. Bye-bye.